City. Mike Tyson stopped Carl The Truth Williams at 93 seconds of the first round to retain his heavyweight boxing title. Williams got knocked down with a huge left hand that came out of nowhere, got up at the count of seven, and seemed ready to continue. However, referee Randy Newman saw the truth in Carl's eyes, maybe. Here are the final seconds of the bout as CBC saw. But Tyson, uh, very, very tough on that uppercut. I'm going to party. All right, that's it. I'm here. Here we go. Right. People do not give Mike Tyson enough credit for his quickness in there and where he hit you. The referee had a closer view than I did, so I guess he called the shot right. But I, I thought he was going to get up because it was a good shot. But I really, I don't know. I don't think it was that hard. I wasn't hurt to the point where I couldn't have continued. I wasn't even hurt to the point where, where I was in the, where I was in the, where I was um, on Queer Street, so to speak. I wasn't moving around. I wasn't wiggling. I wasn't falling down. There's nobody that can beat me. There's nobody that can beat me. Well, he's got that right, I think. Here's another look at the punch that ended it. Tyson bringing that left hand out of the ground somewhere, and Williams goes crashing to the canvas. One punch says it all. Williams said later, yeah, I was stunned, but I wasn't on Queer Street. And those are his words. Referee Newman thought otherwise. He's asking him, hey, are you okay? You all right, Carl? Williams couldn't answer, and Newman said the fighter's hands were dead at his side. It was a TKO, the fifth knockout, the fifth fastest knockout in heavyweight championship history. Mike Tyson wins his 10th championship.